Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther, and today we're we'll checking out how to do this paper text effect in Illustrator. First step, let's select the text. Um, actually, I'm gonna leave it like this. I'm gonna press and hold Alt to drag it down. And I'm gonna go to the gradients, activate the black and white gradient. I'm gonna type in here 90 degrees. And as you can see, the dark side is on the top. Uh, the light side is on the bottom. We need to switch this. So we got here the reverse gradient. Click on it. I'm gonna press the letter E. Or you can go and select the free transform tool. And as you can see, a new menu is gonna pop up, which is this one. And we're gonna select the perspective distort. And I'm gonna drag it from this corner inside. So as you can see, it starts to distort. There you go. Perfect. So I'm gonna create a new copy of this one. Press and hold Alt, drag it down, and I'm gonna squeeze it, something like this. And I'm gonna pull all the way up. Also press and hold Shift to isolate. And I'm gonna make them intersect right at the letter A. So it looks something like this. I'm gonna select both, go to object, go to blend, click on make. And it starts to create some copies. I'm gonna double click on the blend tool, select specify steps, increase the numbers however you like. I'm gonna go with like six, click okay. I'm gonna go to the object, expand, click okay. Right click, transform, reflect, and we're gonna do this horizontally. So it's gonna go upside down, click OK. And I'm gonna place the typography, the original one, where they intersect right here. And I'm gonna press and hold Shift, scale it down somewhere around here in that corner. And I'm gonna scale this down also, this part. Yeah, something like this. And this is how you make this paper text effect in Illustrator. Thanks for watching and if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye-bye.